Well, we are learning more and more about Thomas Matthew Crooks, uh, the 20-year-old who took the shots at Donald Trump and then was killed by Secret Service snipers. This, again, is just 20 years old, so uh, a lot of the people who are speaking out about him are friends of his, uh, people who knew him in high school, and they are showing us more about what he was like. We actually uh, have obtained a video here that was, it's a video, you're gonna hear Thomas actually speaking in this, where he is um, joking around with friends. Again, they are in high school. I'm not sure, uh, this was 10th grade actually, so very young, um, and joking around about, it seems like they're talking about how they would present themselves on social media. Six foot four. Um, I go to uh, Stanford oh, University. Um, I have a, a, a ten inch penis. Okay, tenth graders. So, so sophomore humor. To it's say the it's least. just the juxtaposition of of a kid, kid who is just making you know dumb jokes, mm -hmm. then ending up here. Yeah, it is just remarkable. Um, the other thing that's interesting about him is while he was in high school. Uh, he tried to get into the rifle club, and he was rejected because he was a terrible shot. Yeah. And that's really interesting. He could not hit the target. In fact, he was like 20 feet from the target as he was shooting. Um, that may actually have voted well for President Trump. Yeah, uh, but there are, people are describing him as an outcast, um, that he did not, had, or the words were weird interactions with some of his classmates. They weren't specific um, about that. Yeah, but also yeah, but we are starting to get a little bit of a portrait of, of, of who this kid was. As you said, the rifle team didn't accept him because he was a bad shot, but they also mentioned that he was he would say off things, and there was some reference to it being uncomfortable because you're dealing with rifles. Even in a, in a shooting scenario on a team, it may not have only been that he was a bad shot, but that also he was saying things that were making people uncomfortable, and you're starting to get a, a sort of view of this, of this kid and what he dealt with in high school and how it may have contributed to his actions.